is a K-Gun 9 On Your Side news update. Thank you for joining us. I'm Pat Paris. There is a push to stop victim blaming in southern Arizona. It comes from Emerge, the Center Against Domestic Abuse. Through social media, Emerge wants to raise awareness about this issue. It says it's important to change someone's point of view from why do they stay to why does their partner think it's okay to use abusive behavior. Um, but our ultimate goal is accountability. And even beyond that, it's about creating safety for their partner and us yelling and screaming at that person um, for using those abusive behaviors in no way encourages them to, to be safer with their partner. And so we feel good in the moment. Their partner is going to ultimately pay the price for that. If you or someone you know is dealing with domestic violence, you can call the crisis hotline phone number on your screen right now, 888-428-0101. Multiple Tucson area quick trip gas stations are low on gas. A spokesperson tells KGUN 9 uh, that outages are affecting premium and mid-grade fuel. As of now, regular unleaded is still fine. It released a statement to did quick trip that said in part, we are working with numerous partners within the industry to secure additional supply for our premium and mid-grade customers. We do believe the issue is short-lived. Kyler Diggs, the cold uh, just north of Speedway quick trip was out of regular unleaded for a little while this morning when I happened to be trying to get gas. But they did replenish their supply. Uh, well, that's good to hear. And we're going to have a lot of wind around here over the next few days, especially on Monday. So maybe you can get a tailwind so you won't have to use quite as much gas, save a little bit there. But if you got that headwind on Monday, good luck to you. 97 degrees on Friday. It could be the warmest day of the year if we go to 98. We'll see how that works out. 94 on Saturday, 92 Sunday. But then here comes that system with the wind on Monday. Even a slight chance of afternoon and evening showers and thunderstorms there and highs dropping back into the 80s. So I think we're going to remain below 100 for right now. Sounds good to me. Thank you, Kyler. For more news and weather updates, head to our website, kgun9.com. Follow us on social media as well. Thanks for joining us.